Hey guys, this is all streamed out back with another episode of WWE 2K20. And this is the Four Horsewomen Showcase. And last time we did Bailey versus Charlotte Flair on Raw for the Women's Championship. And today we're going to be going to WWE Fastlane from 2017. We are going to be playing as Sasha Banks against Nia Jax in a one-on-one -on -one match. So let's go ahead and get into this. The Four Horsemen weren't the only superstars doing serious work during the Women's Revolution. You can't talk about the Women's Revolution without mentioning Asuka and her incredible strike style, or Ember, her acrobatics, or Paige, Alexa Bliss, Naomi, Tamina, Alicia Fox. They were all tough competitors, every single one of them. And you can't forget about Nia Jax. Perhaps the most powerful force the women's division has ever seen. We met before, and it hadn't gone so great for me. Oh! And Nia Jax beats the boss. Wow. Then I fought her at Fastlane, and look, I'm the boss. It takes a lot to face me. But Nia Jax? Well, she didn't compete like anyone I faced before. Ah! I'm the boss! And I mean, I still beat her. It's me we're talking about. But that wasn't easy. All right, and here we go against Nia Jax. We need to damage Nia Jax in the ring. And this one should probably be hard, simply because uh, she is so much bigger than us. WrestleMania is on the line here. The woman who wins here makes a strong case for the Raw Women's Title. Go. Banks delivering big time offense. Let's just hope Banks has enough. And we got that. So now, okay, front standing strike in the corner. Okay, so we need to get her facing the front in the corner. That should do it. There we go. She'll push us off. Drop kick to the knee. Drop kick to the chest. Mmm. That has really got to hurt. That's a good backbreaker. Dragon Sleeper 1. Okay, we couldn't do anything. Okay, now we can. We lost our debuff. But this isn't something Banks can do over time. There's no overcoming Nia Jax next week or next month. She has to do it tonight or she has failed. Whoa, it's another reversal. There we go. I've never done the Dragon Sleeper, so there it is. Okay, front standing strike in the ring. There we go. So we're trying to choke, she's trying to bear hug. There we go, now we're on the back, just a regular sleeper. Great strategy, great 
Okay, she'll back us right into the ropes. We're gonna climb. Oh, you just get right back on. Good snapmare by Naya. The irresistible force just too much for the boss. How much does Sasha have left? I'm glad Nia Jax is in the ring tonight because now we can see a real boss. Nia Jax has a business degree. She's been on building. Okay, so we need to Yep, we're out. We just need to damage her in the ring. Right, she gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. Running close line. It looks like Sasha Banks is setting a very good pace now. There we go. We got the backstabber. And the ropes will break this one up. Looks like she's got a new lease on life here, Cole, but can she cap? Okay, so we need to get to the feet. Wow, what a sequence. Okay. So let's do that. Okay, so the feet. There it is. Okay, so let's go ahead and we'll get out of that. Uh, we need a running front grapple. Okay, and that would not have been a grapple anyway. Okay. Ooh, she'll slam us right down. There's a leg drop. And she'll pick us up. And, okay, that was probably going to be a Samoan drop. We're just going to roll her up. We'll bridge. And we got it. Just like that, we beat, we beat uh, Nia Jax. And for that, we got uh, Sasha Banks and Nia Jax, both from 2017, along with the Fastlane Arena from 2017 and 1000 VC. And in the next episode, we're going to be going to WrestleMania 33. And that's uh, from 2017. We're going to be playing as Bailey in a fatal four-way elimination match against Sasha, Charlotte, and Nia Jax. And I want to thank everybody for watching. My name is Allstream. That hit that like and subscribe button and ring the bell for notifications.